Okay, hello. We have, since the last video, we've tried to make, like, I think three other videos, and they all fell flat because, like, one was like, oh, hey, look, it's Oryx, we should make a video, and then I almost died and instantly had to leave, so that was a bust. And then the exact same thing happened with a snake pit. But, anyways, I got to level 20. Reggie's level 18, I believe. I think he's 18. Correct. Hey, look at that. Correct. And, um, yeah, so we're at the gods. Fighting the gods, trying to get loot, hopefully showing you guys some techniques to fight different types of gods. Okay, this is a Medusa. The best thing to do is to either strafe her if you're fast enough, just circle around her, or if you're not fast enough, just back up. That is the best way to fight her. Okay, this is Leviathan that we're getting shot at. He has ridiculous range, incredible speed, tons of damage, tons of bullets. He's probably one of the hardest ones to fight. If there's basically anything else. I don't else. like it. I don't either. I'm backing away. Okay. We never saw him once on screen, but people have to just take my word for it. This thing is called a Jin. It's one of the easiest. It's actually already dead. You couldn't even see it happen. Um, what he does is he's invincible until he starts shooting bullets. And he'll just move in a straight line towards you and then drop his guard. So if you're a class like the wizard or... Um, the archer who has decent range, you can just back away from him and then kill him in like one huge burst. Oh my lord! He also doesn't have very much health. This is a huge pile of we don't know what. The best thing to do in this case is to walk away and hope you don't run into what we just ran into. <laughs> I just maxed this. I'm like, okay. I slammed Q so many times it took me to the load screen. Not even the Nexus, like the change your character screen. And that's your gonna be your experience with the gods. Have a good old time. Alright, so... Um, if you haven't bound Q for Return to Nexus yet, do it. Yeah, do that. Now. Do that immediately. Okay, so that Jin dropped a Tier 8 Mithril Armor, which I can't use, but I can feed oh. to my pet. So, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Oh, also Reggie checked his vault, and it turned out he had a bunch of really good stuff for the wizard. So he got me this super nice level 3 spell, he got me this level 7 staff, and he got me level 9 robes. Whereas all the stuff I had before was all level 0. So, big you thumbs go. up. Big ol' thumbs up to Reggie on that. Friendship gaming! Yeah! Everyone benefits! Alright, I'm at the go. Okay, let's see. Yeah. Maybe. Not sure. Maybe not. Looks like maybe. Looks like nope. No. I'm gonna teleport into this area that has five priests. Heal me! Oh, wait, it's the gods. Okay, sweet. So yeah, hopefully um, I can, or we can just give you guys some tips on fighting gods, and that's what this video will be Don't like. Die. I heard a bag drop. It was purple. Inside the bag is a ring of superior speed! Yeah, I guess that's Reggie's tip is don't die. That's a good one. Don't um, die. Don't go in demon portals. Don't go in demon portals. Reggie has given true advice. Oh, it's another Medusa! Oh gosh, I thought she was dead. But now I am the one who is punished for my hubris. Um, that's a Ghost King. His pattern for bullets is really simple. <gasps> Undead king it's portal. A common farm egg. Oh, hey, good, good, good. Let's not go in the undead lair. I've never made it through one of those. I yeah, let's not. I suppose later we're gonna have to, but let's let's make a couple successful videos before we get ourselves moited and then have to refarm characters. Oh gosh, these are sprite gods. They have ridiculous range. Oh, and that's an ant god. He's got really fast anger. Didn't do much damage. Best thing to do against him is just back up in a straight line and he'll walk straight at you. As long as you are a long range class, he'll walk right into your bullets and you can kill him without taking much damage. Oh, purple bag. Inside the bag is tier 7 robe. Okay, so for sprite gods, you need to try to dodge their bullets and slowly get in range. Alright, then there was a like slime blobble. I think that's a slime god. I don't know, the only way you can learn the names of stuff is if they kill somebody, so you kind of have to hope that like a low-level person teleports to you and then dies, and then you can learn what stuff is called. That's about it. Oh, we're getting chased down by another Leviathan. I left, because I... I... You should definitely put that thing... Okay, that's the Leviathan! The We've stage. seen it! Confirmed! It's real! What's happening? I'm sorry, Reggie, I freaked out. Oh. So, yo, 
put your reload in a... Oh, storage? Yeah. Yeah, that would be smart. Okay, so we just kill Leviathan. Go us. As you kill gods, you slowly build fame, which um, doesn't have a lot of use. You can use it to feed your pets, which helps you upgrade your pets. And then, like Reggie said earlier, pets don't lose progress if you die, so I guess it's good in that way. These are beholders. The white bullets just do standard old bullet damage, and then the pink bullets blind you, so dodge the pink ones. Oh wait, I found a potion of defense. That is the rarest and most sought after Ooh. expensive valuable potion. So I'm gonna go back. Um, you should go back. Yeah, I'm gonna go store all that stuff. Yeah, um, the main money in this game is potions, and um, defense potions are the best, I suppose. Because if you drink a defense potion, you'll gain one defense, which reduces all damage by one. So uh, people just like, I mean, doing one potion isn't that impressive, but if you manage to use like 15 of them, then all the bolts will do significantly less damage. And I think the knight is the class with the highest level of defense cap, and it caps like 60 or something. So bolts that would normally do like 100 do 40. Plus, and also they can get armor and rings and stuff. So, like, for me, I'm at risk of getting killed after five bullets, but a knight could take, like... Plus, they have way more health. They can have, like... I don't remember how much. I want to say a thousand, but I feel like that's not right. But it might be. But if that's the case, they can just get shot all day long. However, getting that many defense potions would take forever. So, that's why people like to buy them. Because farming them would be stupid. So people like to just buy them from you. Ooh, it's a horsey. Oh, that thing is scary. I don't know how to deal with the horse. I think it's kind of like a mini boss. Well, even more so than the gods. I don't know. You fight the gods so much because it's like this. Once you get to level 20, it's like, well, that's what you gotta do now. Just gotta fight gods and try to get potions and different better items. And uh, so the gods kind of just turn into like the standard enemy. Standardized. Yep. And then the game is just very difficult. It's like, oh, the standard enemy kills me in two hits. Go ducks. Medusa! Maybe. Oh, Ant Lord! Is that a double Dusa? It's a double Dusa! <laughs> I killed one, and I heard a bag drop. So, if the bag is pink. Where's the bag? Yep, if the bag's pink like this, that means anybody can see it and anyone can take the stuff out of it. If it's purple, then only you can see it. And if it's blue, only you can see it. If it's white, only you can see it. Basically, the only color of bag that the gods will drop that anyone can see is pink. So anything else that's just exclusively for you and you don't have to worry about it getting stolen. But anything in a pink bag probably won't be stolen because it's bad. Blue bags are always potions. Um, weird bags that kind of look like eggs are egg bags, and then white bags are super rare potions and items. Oh my lord! Oh my lord! I've wandered into a bad part of town. I died! Well. Oh. No. Wait, Frick! Nards! I lost all that gear you gave me. That's okay. Thank you. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's the game. It's really okay. It is, it is a game, but this means more grinding. No, no, it's the game, not a game. Oh, okay, it whatever. the whole point is to die. That is so true. Literally, to get on the high scores board, you have to die first before your score is recorded. So, like, the number one guy in the world is like, Yes, I was the best, but now I'm dead, and I will not be the best anymore. So it's kind of... Do you... Hmm? Do you have stuff to put on? Yes, kind of. I have a good robe, and I have a decent spell. What's your staff? Tier zero. Unless I saved one. No. I, I have one for you. Oh, it's thank you. great, but... Thank you. <clears throat> Actually, I think I'm going to leave... Are you in Medusa? Uh, I am at the vault right now. I think I'm just going to stick with my crappy gear and try to scum some levels off the gods. Okay. 
Um, I suppose I will append onto this video, if I get back to level 20, we can continue some gods. But until then, have a wonderful break, you beautiful people. Beautiful people. This is a video about Oryx. This is what happens when you get taken to Oryx. Is from oh, it's Reggie. Hi. Oh yeah. So I got absolutely murdered as a wizard, and I switched to a priest. His ability is healing, and um, that's about it. Uh, yay! Yay! I'm only level 13 right now, and I was just trying to scum experience with gods. Oh, and I don't want to die. But I'm trying to make it through Oryx as much as I can to show you guys kind of what it's like. You can't teleport to anybody here. So you have to be a little careful. Oh, but you still get experience. So I leveled up. Somebody just died a horrible death. Imagine. Oh, I died. No! Well, it's no longer worth it. Teleport out. <laughs> this concludes this <laughs> video. Reggie death. Oh, it's Realm of the Mad God with Reggie. Yeah. And we're Hi. in a snake pit portal. So this is one of the dungeons. One of my two favorites. I like the snake pit. Oh, Lord! What have I wrought? I like the snake pit, and I like the spider den. Spider den is just easy. I don't really think there's any benefits to doing it. You can get, like, a somewhat meh kind of decent sort of ring. Snake pit, you can get snake oil, which works like the pre-special ability, which is an area of effect heal, which is great. And then the final boss usually drops either a potion of speed or... I don't know. I think there's a chance for some pretty good gear. But snake pits Pretty actually bad. seem winnable. But we found one earlier, and I was going to film it, but uh, like two other people joined us, and they just sprinted through. And I tried to follow them, and that's how I died and lost my wizard. Or no, did I just go back to the Nexus? I don't know. I don't know either. But the anyway, point is, we both died. Many yeah. Times. Oh yeah, we both yeah, died a game. bunch of times. That's true. There has not been that update since the yeah. Less. Yeah, Reggie died a bunch. I died a bunch. I died a bunch. My goodness. So we're both trying to work our way back up to level 20. I'm currently level 16 and Reggie's level 8-ish, 9-ish. I am level 10. Hey. So actually this snake pit would be doing work for you then. The archer is pretty much made for places yeah. like this where there's like a thousand little enemies because he shoots a ton of bullets that pierce enemies. And the priest actually shoots bolts at pierce enemies, which I don't think used to be the case, but he must have got updated. Yeah. The priest has the longest range yeah, of any class, good. but he kind of sucks at fighting. And yeah, his special ability is area of effect heals. So we're actually pretty much set for this place because even the hardest enemies in the snake pit don't have much health. So being able to pierce enemies means they'll die really quick. And I love having a freaking priest around. Yes, yeah, so much better. Pretty swell. Hey. Okay. So we're just slowly trying to make our way towards the boss. Snake pit is basically like this. You just go into a room. Oh, kill all the snakes! And then move on. Hey, is that another double bow? Or is that a fire bow? It's a fire bow. I'm picking it up in case I, uh... Get, get shot to death. Whoa. You should let me know if your health is running low, because I can't really see. Yeah. Really. I'll just try to keep you managed. I wish there was a health bar underneath your name. Um, in the mm, little friendship bar or whatever. Nice. But all I get... Like, if you're almost dead, it'll start flashing red, but that usually means you have like a tenth health, and then you pretty much die immediately afterwards. So, it's not that helpful. <laughs> no. Yeah, so yeah, Snake Pit is pretty much very chaotic. It goes back and forth between rooms full of tiny and significant little snakes like this and big, big snakes. Oh, this is the boss room, though. Congratulations, us. Okay. This boss is difficult, but there are safe spots. However, she can very easily, slowly wear you down so that you don't have any more potions. It's not so much the case if you're if you have a priest. So we might be here for a while, guys. I'm doing that fast up noise music. I don't know what you're talking that about. That was it, right? Uh, no, it's 
I can't, you know what, I can't do it, I just can't do it. Yeah, I have no idea what you're talking about. Okay, never mind. Joke failed. Joke failed, guys. I'm sorry. Oh, I could use a couple of I'm on my way, but I'm coming over there slowly. Slowly. The annoying oh, thing dear. about the snake lady is that she is mostly invincible all the time. Oh, no she's not. Oh, I'm blind. She spit acid in my eyes. Don't we kill the people who's guarding him? Um, I don't know if it's necessary. But I think we can. But she might spawn more. Huh? They have a lot of health. Yeah, they do. I don't know how much health the Snake Queen has. I'm blind. I can't I see. Know. I'm being shot repeatedly. I love you for healing me. I'm gonna stand here for one second. Alright. Everything's good. I don't even know if I'm hurting her at this moment. Did I get you? Or are you like full health? I am uh, two thirds health. Yes. So yeah, priests are pretty great, especially if you're trying to uh, do a let's play and you'd like to have longevity on your characters. Yes. Ah, uh, snake lady. Oh, That's probably really brutal for you, Reggie. You're like level 10. Yes. She's always invincible. Oh, I'm going to go over here and I'm going to pop a heal because I care. Yay. That used to be our tagline for when we had a priest in our group who'd be getting like murdered, like, pop a heal if you care. And luckily our friends do care, so we would get healed. Yay. And so you'll probably hear me shout that a thousand times. You'll probably hear Reggie shout that a thousand times. Just became our mantra. No, I'm kidding. Don't do it. It's too late. Yeah, I, already, yeah. I already popped. I just popped. Oh my gosh. Ooh, I can't ooh. pop. I have no heals. There we go. Thanks. Freaking snake woman, please. I don't generally... I'm blind. Okay. We don't do a lot of dungeons, so we don't really know like the stratagems for fighting these people. At least I don't. I don't know. Maybe Reggie does. Uh, no. Okay, here we go. Now she's good. That's not her. That's her snake associates are taking taking damage. She took damage for a moment. I think. Oh, okay. Sweet. I think she's like the the Gian, where she only takes damage when she's firing. I'm blind. I'm gonna hide behind this wall. And getting back after it. She is at about half health. Last time I saw her health bar pop up. So we're making progress. But I guess until then I'm just going to try to stay near her so I can see what's happening and dodge bullets. Oh yep, she's vulnerable. I'm vulnerable! <laughs> oh, I, love you. I love you for that pop. I do too. I was freaking out. Uh oh. Frickin... She is still invincible. Oh, she's down to like a quarter health. Cool. Oh, she's vulnerable. She's now invulnerable. My gosh, they all aggroed onto you in like a second. <laughs> I've used three of my health potions. And I could use a pop. I, I just it. popped. Ah, so close. Yeah, I got blinded. 
And... Hey! We beat her! Oh, she's still got minions. Get the F out! I got a speed potion. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. And that is the snake lair. I hope you enjoyed. <sighs>